y'all know why I really feel like every now and then I get to the point where I just feel like this game has me by man just because like you ever sit here and be like bro I'm too smart for this shit tell y'all something man I had a I had an IQ test done when I was six none of this shit don't mean shit because it's just 2k but it's like maybe I was six or seven like 148 something like that genius and a genius level intellect at that point in time so obviously my whole life I've seen things differently and I approach things differently than the average person that ain't no problem but it don't take a genius to know when you're ass at a game and that's just what this bro I'm playing against a dude earlier man you know what dude told me dude said bro why you getting mad at me I'm balling I'm four for eight you ain't do nothing Say, bro, I got, I'm two out of three. He's like, so I got more points. If you don't realize that two for three is a higher percentage than four for eight, then bro, what, what can I really do for you, my boy? Like, it just be like, like, and that, and did like, and he was a grown man. Bro, these are the people that's gonna lead our nation one day, bro, or already leading the nation to something, bro. I, I don't get it, it just be like, I understand when kids say dumb shit, but when grown ass men say dumb shit like that, it just, bro, I don't know, man. If you don't know that two for three is a higher percentage than four for eight, my boy, I don't know. I don't know what to tell you, my guy. It is what it is, man, but that ain't what we here to talk about, man. We here to talk about, it's just like when you be seeing the game, you see everything that's happening. Like like I was telling y'all earlier today, I, we run an adaptive zone. Some people just can't, some people can't, not only can they not run an adaptive zone, they can't wrap their head around that shit out of here. I already knew what you was gonna do, bro. Oh shit. Hey, they not only can they not run an adaptive zone, yeah, they can't wrap their head around a regular zone. You understand? Like, and then they do stuff like that, just file you right out to the place just for nothing. They can't even wrap their head around a regular zone. A regular zone. These are basketball basics, my guy. Look at this dude. Okay, pass it to him. Why not? Green Bean Money Team! Why not pass it to him when I'm wide open? But they can't wrap their head around regular basketball basketball stuff can you get down there you go and that's it's sad because these are basic basketball principles it's basic basketball principles this is why the game can't go nowhere because people think that the game is just running up and down the court do two moves that should work every time and dunk on somebody that's not basketball it's just not that's not what basketball is basketball is number one a game of deception number two Bro, you got you, you got to get here. I'm here though. Basketball is is number one a game of deception. Number two, and this is important, it's a game of skill. It's a game of uh, this basketball. Do you, do you ever wonder why when people get older, they play the game at a different level? And it's like, yo, if he if he was like that when he was young, he would have been super nice. But he's old now. And he can't move no more. And this dude got nicer because they figured out that basketball is a game that's played mostly above the neck. If you play basketball above the neck in most situations, you're going to beat your opponent. That's just all to it. It's not about being quicker, faster, stronger, you know, all that stuff. That's part of it. But right, you see me right here? If he passed the ball now, I'm not, I'm not going to be able to do that. You see what I'm saying? Like, it's a game of deception. Make you do what I want you to do. And when you do it, then I'll come back the other way and I'll do something else or, you know, whatever like that. You know, you're going to talk. Bro, no! You should never. Hey, just get through the screen, bro. Don't don't worry. Don't worry about the center. I got the center. Just get through the screen. I'm going I'm to stay there till you get there. Like, like stuff like that. Like, he don't realize that, of course, he's going to shoot that and smoke it. He don't realize that that's what I'm doing, that all I'm doing is hedging and stuff like that. Like, it's, it's crazy. Now I understand that we don't got the comms and all that. There you go. Get through it. Look, same thing. Look, I'm going to get back to this, though. Man, they really made me. And CDN 2K does stuff like that, and they force me to go out of bounds. It is what it is, though, man. Look, right, right here. I can't dive because he, all he's doing is reaching. Now I can go to the corner with this guy. Now I can fall. He's going to step. Kick it to me. Trays up, green bean money team, splash down. This is what basketball is about. Basketball is not about 
hit you with a move, run up, run up the court, do do the do the most simple behind the back that I can do, and that automatically gets you past. It's not about doing like it's like how T them dribble. T will T will full on make you think that he's gonna go left, and then he'll go behind his back to the right. I, I don't know what that is. He thought that since I hit mine, he should be able to hit his or something like that. I guess that shit out of here. Hey, like I said, man, this this is what basketball is about. You should have to think when you play basketball. You shouldn't just be out here on autopilot when you're playing a game. Got real scene, freaking and mean. You know the jump shot green, keep it a bean. And in the lane, baby, flow the soft with a lean. And when you put me on the block, call me the dream. And I really played the game. I know the rules, don't give me half ass shit. I know the moves. Plus, I know you like the video, so hit that like. Really played in front of big crowd. But y'all understand what I'm trying to tell y'all, man, right? Like, basketball is not just this simple. The way that they simplify basketball in this game is not how it should be. You should never feel like just because you scored more points, you carried the team in any way. If you shot a bad percentage, you shot, especially in a game like this, bro, if you shoot 50, if you shooting 50% or less, you really didn't, that's, that's not good. Like people used to be like last year, well, I'm shooting 50%, you know, 60% from the field, 50% from three. That's not good. Not for this game. And like I said though, but like I see, I see the whole thing differently, man. I just see it like, and there's a lot of players out there. There's a there's a lot of people out there with, with high IQ. And we want the game one way. And then you got a lot of people out there with the mean IQ. When I'm saying the mean IQ, I'm just talking about average IQ. They got average IQ. And they want the game another way because they can't wrap their mind around the game being more than just two clicks and then I can go to the rim, right? But you got a lot of people out there that want to make, like, like it's a popular term that everybody's saying right now, make it make sense. Like, there's a lot of people out there that want to make the game make sense. It has to make sense. It needs to make sense. This is why games ultimately fail. Because in the beginning, only the people that have the acumen for that game play the game, right? That's who play it first. So, like, in the beginning of the 2Ks, the only people that really like basketball played it. And then you had you start getting people that watch basketball, but they're getting their ass whooped. So, they're getting their ass whooped, and they're like, nah, I don't want to keep getting my ass whooped. 2K knows that, damn, we're selling more copies. Why? Because we have more casuals. Even though these people set it off, we got a lot more casuals on the game. So, we got to dumb the game down for them because they can't make shots. Like, like even me, back, back in the 2K1, uh, 2K, you know, 2K... 2k1 2k2 days i was out there like i could i could set up a play and make it so i could score but it was hard for me to hit the shots i had to practice 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 so that i could you know when i worked the ball open i could hit the shots but a lot of guys like my homeboy andrew andrew just can shoot the ball two people in his face cash one person in his face cash Three people with his face cash. He played with the Supersonics and he played, this is what we would play. We would play 2K and Inside Drive and Live. Back then, he just had a natural ability to just shoot the ball. So yes, there is talent, but it just be like, I had to work. I never had to work to get an open shot because I knew the game of basketball. So I could always work my guys open and get an open shot. I had to work to be able to shoot the ball. He never had to work to be able to shoot the ball, but he had to learn. I had to show him how to work certain defenses and get it and it's just like i said we play an adaptive zone a lot of people can't do that they don't even know what that what i'm talking about when i'm saying adaptive zone it's like the two it's a matchup zone what you want to call it. it's just like the syracuse uh jim Beheim two three matchup or the three two matchup whichever they want to run it's just like playing man except for if the person is in your zone you pick them up and just like I said, they got a 4-1 backside. Then somebody, one person can slide down to the corner. That wing can slide down to the corner sometimes. Or the corner has to come up to the wing, depending on what you're dealing with. It is what it is, man. But it's just like, it's just so crazy that we play these games, we do this stuff. And we say we want a more realistic game, a more, a game that's more conducive to people that actually know but if they do that, then people are gonna start crying and complaining because the people that work themselves open for open shots, they gonna kill, they gonna destroy people. That's where we are right now. But I can definitely understand why people say that takes a lot of the fun out of the game because 
in making a game like that, you gotta slow things down. You gotta slow down. You gotta make it so there's less speed in the game. You gotta make it so that people um. You gotta make it so that that you know people that really don't know anything about basketball are uh, buckets. You know, people that really don't know anything about basketball can still play the game. I get it because it's got to be good for your bottom line, right? It has to be. If something is not good for your bottom line, damn, I thought I was there. If something is not good for the company's bottom line, the company cannot exist. But, bro, we got to find some type of happy medium. Like, bro, do you know how flabbergasted I was when this guy said I was balling and he was doing more than me because... He was doing more than what I was. Green Bay Money Team. He was doing more than I was because he had he had shot four for eight. He like I'm balling, bro. You got a cold ring. You got a whole cold ring on, and you balling because you're just sprinting in there, hoping that 2K lets you hit lets you hit a shot. That's crazy. Now I already know what he want to do next time, so I will step up on that. But it is what it is. I don't even think I saw him get screen. Look at this dude. This center is never gonna come out. He's never going to... Oh, no! Shouldn't have done that, my boy. I ain't going to do that. He going to try to pass it back to him. I'm down here already. He going to try to spin. He can't go nowhere. Here we go. My God. Don't play defense. The center's not playing me, okay? Let's see if he picks up on this. Look, the center going to go there. He's definitely not playing me. He might play me now. Green Bean Money Team trades up. Splash down. But sometimes, bro, you got to figure out what's going on. Like, you got to let the people figure it out for themselves. But at the same time, you got to know, bro, he's doing the same thing every damn time. Y'all haven't realized that? He's just doing that and running to the corner? He's not even coming off of a screen. Good grief. Green. But like I said, like, this is where we are. You see, you see what we're doing? You see what's happening right here? Nobody's like this ain't no good gameplay. Give me that ball. That's us too. This is not good gameplay. Why are you here? You know he can shoot. Why are you here? My boy, you gonna you gonna you gonna pick him up one time, my dog. Like just once. Look at that. Green. Good shot, boy. Good pass. Like if if I don't play a perfect game dog it just ends up being it ends up being bad look now, now look look at that see i have to i got to play that but then that happens all he got to do is play over that's the first time he actually played over and then we was good it is what it is man like i said i can pick up stuff look at this this center's never gonna guard me man except for that one time <sighs> gotta pass the ball early i would have been at the wing it's all good though, man. Like I said, I get that they have to make this game. Pull that. All shot. Bucket! What? I get that they gotta make this game so that stuff like that happens. I understand why. Why they make the game. Why they make the game like they do. Yeah, there you go. You know what he's gonna do. You know he just hesitating, running to the corner and pulling. Hey, when he set that screen, y'all play sides on that. Like I shouldn't have to. I shouldn't have to tell them to play sides when he set their screen. I shouldn't have to do that. But you know what I'm saying? Like the, it should be like, okay, well, the most logical thing. Why would you reach in? Why would you reach? The most logical thing for us to do is to play sides. You know, so you stay on your side, I stay on my side, and we'll be good. There's nothing I can do about that because he won't come over. You play your side, I play my side, and we'll be good. But they're not going to do it. I'm, I'm going to come down and set the screen. He's playing way too low. Playing way too low. Shoot that. He missed. And we lose the game. We ain't lose the game yet. We ain't lose it yet, but it might be it might be done for. Got Pogo Stick. Wow! Like I said, man. I don't I play a perfect game we still lose and that's the tale of the tape that's the tale of two stories bro I don't understand like why that was so hard for y'all all y'all had to do was just play sides on that that wasn't hard at all 
Yeah, wait. That's what I'm saying. He wasn't. He wasn't playing sides. Like I don't understand why he's chasing this guy and he still. I, I don't get it, man. It is. Yeah. Every. Like, everybody don't got basketball like you, man. It is what it is. They make this game so that that anybody can pick it up and play it. Cause what he was doing wasn't even smart. He was just sprinting and pulling the pulling shots. So it's not like. It's not like K. Young was good and then he just did some dumb shit and the shit worked. It just is what it is. Like I said, man, they make this game, they make this game, man, so that anybody can play it. We didn't exploit what we were supposed to exploit. It is what it is, man. Basketball, like I said, none of that stuff helps you. If you have somebody on your team that's bringing the team down enough, what can you do? If you got a player on your team that doesn't understand basketball at all, which is who they really made this game for, and the other guy, he didn't understand basketball either. The only thing he did was set a screen. Like, if I'm playing with anybody else, that shit completely shut down. But it's no point in me raging no more because the way that they made this game is so that bad players can be successful. They made this game so that bad players can be successful. They didn't make it so that players that can actually play can do anything. I promise you, the average person that plays this game, show me somebody that's good besides me and Brute and like Duke or somebody like that that actually play real basketball, that actually really plays basketball. I haven't seen many shakedown people like that. Everybody else look crazy when they on the basketball court. Like, they, it ain't it ain't much to it, man. And I ain't trying to shit on people, but I'm just saying, like, like, People really will win games out here and then they'll come at you like they're nice. Like, bro, it's a video game. It don't take anything other than just knowing what button to press when. That's all it is. It ain't that serious. But, hey, people really feel like, you know, it's just, hey, I got, I'm, I'm raw. I'm like, like, bro, you, you're not doing anything. I look at these people. They, they dribble the ball like this. They don't dribble the ball like they're playing basketball, like they hitting nobody with no move. They dribbling like this. The ball is controlled, and then they dribble like my little boy who's eight. LJ eight. He can't even dribble. That's how that's how people be dribbling. But they play this game, and they nice at this, bro. Anyway, like I said, man, I don't already talk too much, man. The game is really not made for people like me. It's just not. I like to think my way through games. I like to play games where I got to think, where I got to do something, where I got to figure out, react quickly, and all this. I don't, I, I don't play. I'm just not into games where it's like the only thing you do is hit a button and hope like even the dude on my team just now wasn't even that good man but hey it is what it is man like i said man i'm holler to y'all next time i hope you guys enjoyed the video i hope y'all get what i'm saying let me know if you agree down in the comment section should it be should this game be brain dead or should it be something that's, that's like a thinking man's game or something like that? I'm about to play a game where you actually got to think, have some fast twitch and all this stuff, man. I'm about to play that now. If y'all, you know, if y'all agree, let me know. If you don't agree, let me know. It is what it is, man. Everybody's going to have their own opinion, but I just feel like that the game, when it first came out, you had to think, you had to do this, and then, like, bro, after patch 4 2K15, this game been for ultra casuals. They just babysit people and do all this stuff, man. And it's not cool. This, going, this, this is going to be the death of this game. You, you have to find a balance between can decent players beat regular players and then, like, people that actually know the advanced tactics, let them be able to, uh, you know what I'm saying, let them be able to prevail if you know advanced tactics, if you can execute them. Don't make the game so that the only tactics that you can execute are the fucking cheese tactics that everybody does. Like, that's that's just not cool at all. Anyway, man, new jump shot video. Y'all saw the jump shot, man. New jump shot video coming soon, man. I'm out of y'all next time. Till next time. Hey, it's your boy, Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the Barbershop, BK the People's Champ. Godspeed. I know I left out some stuff down there, man, but y'all let me know what I left out, what y'all would like to see, how can 2K balance this game, and I'm out. Peace.